Well, I got my package today. I designed some cards and some stickers. Nanny Homemaker. I'm so excited. A big box with a lot of stuff just for <laughs> a small box, you know. Oh yeah, my mug. Oh my god. Let me just take this all out. I'm so excited. So, let's see what we got. Okay, so these are flyers for merch. So if I want to get my merch done. Okay, let's get the box out of the way here. So you can see that. And I'll sit down too. I'm still in my pajamas. I didn't brush my hair. It's still early in the morning. And the guy showed up at the door, so just want to show you guys what I got. So first off, oh, I got my Natty Homemaker mug. Natty Homemaker mug. Magic spoon. Just a simple mug for myself. I'll probably have these for sale later on down the road when I make a website or a store. And I also got my postcards for advertising. Now, there. Ooh, look at that. And in the back, sign or whatever. So that's just postcards. I'm going to put those around, give them to people I know. <gasps> there we go. That's my sticker. Well, you can't really see it unless you take it off. It's the sticker exactly like this. But I'm going to put that on the sticker for the car. So you put that in the car window. But it says YouTube at the bottom here. It says uh, Natty Homemaker YouTube. And it's got the same de design as this. The only difference is it has YouTube at the bottom. So that's cool. I'm quite happy with that. I need an error for that too. One. <clears throat> and they gave me this little scraper thing to put the sticker on the window. Yeah, woohoo! A little bit of advertising. Quite happy. Yeah. So there's a whole bunch of merch that I could get. So I'm thinking about maybe making bags for shopping, uh, grocery shopping. Well, look what hubby bought me yesterday. Magic spoon, spatula, and a flipper. Just for me. I was so happy. Thank you, love. New spot for my magic spoons. So anyways, um, I was watching TikTok the other day, and we've seen something with kiwi. We do this in the air fryer. Supposedly, it tastes amazing. So we're going to try that for 15 minutes at 175. Let's try this. So you just put it whole. You wash them first. And temperature... 175. Oh, mine doesn't go to 175. Really? What the heck? Okay, 200. And it said 15 minutes. I'll try Ooh, 13 minutes because it's a little bit higher. So 13 minutes. And there we go. Now, we saw this video on TikTok. And the girl was saying it's so good. So we're going to try it. Well, it looks ready. And Jay has to go to work. So I better cut this up and try it out. Okay, so we're going to try cutting one. It's still, it's not mushy or anything. So I don't know. Might not be ready. It might be really hot though, Jay. Mm 
I don't think it's ready yet. But Jay's going to eat it anyways because he's got to go to work. So I'm just going to have a little bite of this one. I might cook the other one a little longer. Ooh, it's very sour. Careful, it's very hot, Jay. That's yours anyways. Ooh, it is sour. Very sour? Okay, so I'm gonna cook mine for another five. Time. Five. Temp. 350. What do you think, Jay? It tastes like it's almost there. It's almost there? Because it does have a hint of an apple, but like a sour apple right now. Sour? Yeah. Okay, so it was uh, a long time to do this thing. So it's not very fast. So I'd say put it in for 15 minutes at 350. Okay. Uh, as you can see, it's starting to split here on the side. So what I'm going to do now is, where is my, let me just hold it with this. Then I'm going to cut it. Hold on. And cut it like that. Oh, it's starting to peel. Okay, so this one's a little bit better than Jay's, I'll tell you that. Jay's like, you could eat the peel. I'm like, I don't want to eat anything hairy. Like, come on. I'm not going to eat this hairy ball. Ball of kiwi, that is. So I'm going to wait. It cools down so I don't burn myself. This is, what, this is what it looks like. It looks like normal kiwi. Just hot. So... This time I'm going to make sure it's not fucking hot where it burns my tongue. That's weird. It does taste like an apple. Let me try that again. The girl said it, said it tastes like apple crumble. I almost don't know where she gets the crumble from, but... Where's my camera on this stupid thing? Yeah, right there. See? Alright. Mmm. That is good. Oh, I would definitely eat kiwi like this again. It would be good with ice cream. Oh. This would be great with ice cream or whipped cream. I just got an idea. Let's try this. So, let me just mix this yogurt up. It's a little watery on the top. So it's an Astro yogurt. Let's see. Astro yogurt. It's peach flavored. Hmm. So I'm just gonna take some of this kiwi. A little bit of yogurt with it. Mm. Mm. Oh boy. Let's try some more. Mm. Let's try this again. Came from the pits of the middle, so the pits of hell where it's really hot. Mmm. Mmm. Guys, you gotta try that. Kiwi with the skin. Put it in the air fryer at 350, 15 minutes. Cut it in half. Get yourself some yogurt. Get yourself some cream. Whatever you like. Even ice cream. And wow. 
game changer. Now I got the idea for the kiwi on TikTok. Another girl did this, but I added this to it. And I really think that ice cream would be amazing with this. Definitely. I got some more because it's just so good. So yummy. Mmm. Blow. Yogurt. Mmm. Mmm. Delicious. Cut some up there. Add it to my yogurt. Just gonna mix that up. Mmm. I've got just a couple little pieces here on the plate. There we go. Mmm. Total game changer. Good for a diet too. Kiwi and yogurt. Mmm. Mmm.